we can quantify the change in the, in the threshold voltage um, due to this um, source to body voltage. So let's first look at the space charge region. Um, when, when or how much charge is in the space charge region when we have no source to body voltage. Okay, so that's this equation uh, that we looked at before. Now if we do put a substrate bias, so the source to body voltage is greater than zero, then the new space charge equation will be the same one except we're adding the effect of the source to body voltage there. So we can define a, a change in the space charge region uh, charge density. That's just the, uh, the difference in the, in the two equations. And that will correspond to a change in the threshold voltage needed to maintain inversion by dividing the change in the charge in the space charge region, charge density, divided by the oxide capacitance. And this equation, oops, this equation will now tell you uh, what the change in threshold voltage will be depending upon what your source to body voltage is.